Welcome everyone to the ultimate game in the The freaking national championship, dude. Oh. With all the crap that I've talked about my defense all freaking season long, there ain't no there was no way in hell I ever thought I was gonna be in this freaking game. With the defense playbook change from the last game, we we played pretty good against Notre Dame defensively. Stuff like we could have done better, but we um it was definitely better than the first meeting against Notre Dame, but running the same defensive playbook this game four two five so hopefully it does its job shit Syracuse twelve and four number nine I don't know how the fuck they made it to the national championship but let's not underestimate them you know this is gonna end up looking like a freaking K State game. <laughs> K State was full of shit. <laughs> I played so bad in that game. When we played against K State, uh, K State, I freaking, I honestly played down to the level, and it just nearly screwed me up. Well, here we go. The energy in this building is absolutely amazing, Kirk. We are just 60 minutes away from crowning a new national champion in college football. And think about it as a player. Let's try something real quick, dude. This is what you work towards having an opportunity to get to the national championship. Both these teams have worked hard. Now they're here. Let's see how it plays out. Looking to pass, it's Moss. Looks to the left. Pass caught. And the defense swarms not much of a gain on that completion. And the Trojans come to the line in a hurry up. Tight end goes in motion before the snap. From the shotgun. Well, that was a nice fucking. They tackle him right at the 30. That was a nice hole right there. Defense trying to dig in here on this. I like it that. Down and inches. Try and muscle for the first ship. Sure. The Trojans are going to keep this drive moving. How aggressive will they be on this first down play? Boy, the defense misses out on an opportunity to get off of the field. They got the offense to third down, and they just weren't able to prevent them from converting. Bro, they got like two people on that line. What the fuck? <laughs> Motherfuckers, if you're gonna be doing that, I'm gonna be running all over you. Better put you better put the whole house on the frickin' line. Coming in here and disrespecting my D-line like that. Not my D-line, my frickin' running game like that. Oh, good block, man. That's a great block. Oh, my God. Amazing. No, that's not what I want. That's what I want. Quick completion to the tight end. He'll get the first down yards before they finally bring him down. And the Trojans are going to take advantage of this red zone trap. Receiver in motion now. They're going to run it here. Oh, I should have stiffed arm him. I should have given him the old stiffy, bro. You know what I mean? Get an RPO real quick. So the homie Branch. Oh, Branch got this, dude. Ah, come on. And they stop him just short. The defense really backed up now. It's first and goal. And the Trojans will line up here on first down and goal. Nah, I don't like it. Let's do that. And 
And the tight end goes in motion before the snap. Go try to <laughs> I mean, when you got three people on the fucking line, man. You know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Let's go, man. Show who we are. So Syracuse's offense makes their way onto the field for their first possession. Well, we got guys that can make plays as well as anybody in the country on both sides of the ball. That's why I think this matchup is so exciting. Two good teams with great individual players. On first and ten, they'll look to throw it. Oh. That one falls incomplete. Good defensive play brings up second down. Chris, I don't know if it's the hype of the national championship, the timing between the quarterback and his receivers, but they have not been able to get anything going at all here in the first half. And the problem is they're already down in this game. They've got to put the ball through the air and start hitting some passes, or there's no chance they come back and have a chance to win. That's the wide receiver coming in motion. Watch that. Oof. Oof. For the first down. What? From defenders. They get him down, but the junior with an excellent run there. Right, I see what you guys are on about. Well, it's a great job here by the I see what you guys are on. To be able to pick up the first down. It's gonna be one of them games now. I like it. I respect it. They can get back into this game is converting on third down. It's exactly what they were able to do. I respect it when they come out and fucking no huddle, dude. Offense right to the line, playing with tempo now. One way to create a rhythm and really start to show your identity as an offense is to control the line of scrimmage. The offensive line here early getting a hat on a hat, and this back is... Oh! All year. I feel like he could have caught that, actually. Let's hit the, uh, bring a defense of Blitz here. Nice. Play conservative over here. Offense been in reverse here. Now a long way to go to convert this third down. Dropping back. We're gonna throw for the first down. To screen oh, shit. Come on. To the running back. He's not gonna get Come on. <laughs> Alright. So they're short on fourth down, and the coach decides to try out the field goal team. Syracuse gonna have to prove to me why they're here, man. I don't know. I know why I'm here. This one is right through. Boy, this guy has such a strong leg. No problem. Up into the net from 50 plus. So after the field goal, the kicker out there again to boot it away. Bring it out. It's Fowler. Damn. Tackle at the 14. Not very good All right. position to start here. This should be the last play of the quarter. Oh, 71, bro. Come on. What you doing? Get together. They flipped into the field. We're set for the second quarter, and the national championship trophy is in the building. Offense getting set for a second down here to begin the quarter. They go with the ground game here. Running back takes the handoff. That was a nice fucking change right there. I like it. Gonna hand this off. Oh, what a move! They bring him down, but a solid game there on first down. Looks to be just inches short of the marker. And the Trojans looking to use the up-tempo offense here. A pop pass 
pass on the jet sweep. And he's tackled, but only after picking up a first down. No huddle here for the offense. Out of the shotgun, he'll hand it off. Not much on that play, brought down short. Second down after that run on the previous play. Do we got this here? Skirt! Uh huh, skirt! The Trojans will line up on first and ten. Boy, just a great throw and outstanding accuracy by this USC quarterback. We always know over the years that SC has as much history as anybody at this quarterback spot and sure is living up to that right now. Back to throw. It's Moss. Oh, you freaking idiots, man. They, like, bumped into each other. Wow, this quarterback and his receivers are... Dun, dun, dun. Jeez. to find a rhythm if they want to move the ball down the field. Incomplete. Second down coming up. Offense looking to throw the ball. Snags a quick throw. It, <clears throat> but that completion good enough for first down yardage. Offense in hurry up mode. This offense is clicking and clearly everything seems to be working. Coordinators calling good plays. The quarterback and the rest of his receivers and running backs are executing. And I love it. This oh, 71, dude. Fuck. It's always 71. Decent game that time. Big Goofy? Come on. And the single back oh, I like it. Handoff. And that run produces a decent game. How far is now operating in the red zone, facing a third and short in the 20. <clears throat> the pre-snap motion from the offense. Hit that shit, dude. The hell? Can they pick up the first on the ground? There you go. And the Trojans looking to keep this drive rolling. The offense going with the hurry up. Looks like the QB is changing the play at the line. Mm. It's the two minute warning of this close, competitive first half. First and ten now for the offense. Hmm. Stick with the run. He hands it off from the gun. To 71, I swear to God, dude. If you were to enter the transfer portal right now, I, if you entered the transfer portal this offseason, I, I wouldn't even care. Honestly. Everyone plays their asses off on this old line. And all you do is dick around. <laughs> Keep it on the ground on first and goal. Couldn't quite get in, but they're knocking on the door at the one. Chris down here inside a 10 yard line. These are tough yards to come by. Positive yards. Good push inside there by that offensive Kill some clock here. Defense getting very heavy here. We're gonna stuff the run. Kill some clock, make sure they don't they have fuck all time to even do anything right now. Run it again. So they get closer, but now they line up on third and goal from the one. <clears throat> I'm gonna make sure I don't take off too much clock here, <laughs> just in case they get me again. <laughs> we'll do it like at the nine second right here. Right. And it's 
Syracuse not ready, man. They're not ready. They're not ready. They don't know. They don't know the kind of season I had, dude. I don't think I should be here. That's what I'm saying. But we're here. We fucking played our asses off. Syracuse? I don't know. Four losses, dude. You ain't supposed to be here. You're really not supposed to be here. But I respect it. I respect it. Bum, 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 bum. And that will do it for the first half here. Kevin Connors now has our halftime update. Chris, thanks. What else might we expect in a game of this magnitude? They have one passing yard. On this battle with the coveted gold trophy at stake. And I get it. A lot of coaches will say the difference between winning and losing comes down to stopping big plays and getting big plays. But if you ask me, it's more about how good you are on third down and how efficient you are in keeping drives alive. You know what I missed that I just randomly thought of right now? Because I've talked about this with the homie the other day, but if you guys remember, if you guys played the older NCAAs, like the old NCAAs, I don't know if they had this in 13 and 14, but back in the older older ones that i used to play from 06 to 12. i remember playing was it 09 i think you used to be able to put there they used to be able to put damn near freaking anyone at quarterback so this list would be like much longer and there'd be like running backs and, and wide receivers dude i used to put the fastest guy that i had and I put him at quarterback. I remember there was I had my dynasty mode going one time. I forgot what year I was on, but I had this one fast ass receiver, dude. I'd I'd put him at at quarterback sometimes, just to run like option plays and shit. It was so disgusting. <laughs> I mean, I understand why they won't do that now, but that shit was so fun, dude. Well, actually, with the position, uh, they have position changes, right? Going into the offseason? I might have to do that, bro. I'm going to put someone I'm going to put someone on that list. That shouldn't be there. He's going to be fast. And we're going to have set plays for that dude, man. The entire game, putting everything on this quarterback in their passing game. Just a short gain this time. They're able to get him down. Third down. This offense could really use a conversion here. Down multiple scores. Dropping back. Look at the throw for the first down. Syracuse don't want to be here, bro. They don't want to be here. They 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 were they were accidentally put into this game, bro. They don't want to be here. I'm sorry, man. I feel no pressure playing against these guys whatsoever, dude. I just don't. On the return, it's Branch. Oh, he fast. He fast. Sure. See, he's a dangerous return man. They finally grab him, but he sets the offense up in pretty good field position. And the USC offense is back out on the Let's see if we could uh let's see if we could hit him. Let's see if they've been watching film or not, bro. You know Notre Dame was watching film, that's for sure. Nah, they haven't been watching film. They haven't been watching film, coach. Uh-uh. Tackle, but Oh no, Branch! Bro, you did not look hurt. You're over there throwing with the V's for, V for victory, dude. Come on. You're bullshitting right now. I need you. Fresh set of downs. It's first and ten. Oh, 
It's a shotgun run call. If I was due, if I broke that in dude right there, I was gone. I was gone. No, I don't want that. Uh, let's do that. To the air, it's Moss. He's got it near the end zone. Tackle after the catch, but the ball moves to the four-yard line. Here comes a crucial second-down play. Every yard tough to find down here in the red zone. And there's the handoff. Too easy, man. Too easy, dude. Yo, get these guys out of here, bro. They don't belong here. Get him out of here! Here a little bit if you're the assault offense. That touchdown can help you out, but now your own defense can help you preserve. Bruce Ribs, that's the last game of the season. You're coming back, bro. I don't give a shit. Now the kickoff team is out on the field. And he'll leave the kickoff right there. We'll start from the 25. Let me double check something, bro. Hold on. All right, just making sure, man. You know, because these past couple games that I played, they were they were pretty tough, and right now we're just beating the shit out of these guys right now. Oh shit! Damn. Second down, we're going to throw it. Grab near the sticks. It's Pena. Not much. Pena. Catch, but it is good enough for a first down. A new set of downs after that completion. That's a nice pick up there. They find some space in the zone and pick up the first down. Ah, damn it. I hate the hits. I just don't like the hit stick in this game, dude. <laughs> hit stick used to be dangerous in the old games, man. Oh my gosh. Hell no. And the sophomores got him for a sack. Well, here we are in the national championship, and you always talk about has a nice lead, and a large portion of that has to do with the way they've been able to get after this quarterback. That's the second sack in this game. Tackle finally made. That's a very solid gain, but not close to first down yardage yet. Drops back, needing a third down completion here. Jeez, dude. That dude's getting fucking punked down there, bro. <laughs> uh, Fuck it. Take it. Let's do this. Uh-huh. 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 Coach, they don't want to be here. Send them home. Send them home. <laughs> <laughs> they don't want to be here, man. <sighs> that could be a moment we never forget. A punt return to the house in a championship game. Yo, that was like our first punt return to the house, huh? How often do you see this season? Like this, taken all the way back for a touchdown. You talk about a game-changing opportunity for this team. We'll see if they can finish this game off after that. And the point after is good. Here's the kickoff team. Let's see if they give the returner opportunity to... Yo, who let these guys into the fucking national championship, man? Who let them in? I need to know. Motherfuckers gave you guys a fake ID, man. They are not supposed to be here. offense back on the field. The last possession, they were forced to kick it away. Can they finally get things going this time? This line getting set up. It's a first down play. Scanning the field, it's McCord. Mm -mm. The pass is incomplete. Mm -mm. Drop the first down attempt here across the middle. Well, these guys just continue to struggle throwing the football. You know, whether it's been running the wrong route, the quarterback not being accurate, the offensive line not doing their job. It's been a collective effort, and it's a big oh my god, I suck. No, 
They bring him down to the 38, but that's good enough for a first down. Well, Chris, Yo, when was SC's last national championship, dude? That show was definitely during the Pete Carroll era, huh? Use his vision and patience to allow that play to open up and then accelerate it through the hole to give him... I'm trying to think, we ain't won shit after that. Right? Boy, how about that play, Chris? Unless I'm just drawing a blank somewhere, but... Through there with great acceleration. What a pick up there on first down. And they'll try to pick it up on the ground. I mean, I wish Caleb would have brought a fucking national title home, man, but jeez. That motherfucker was legit a one-man team, dude. That motherfucker was the most exciting player that I've seen since, like, fucking Reggie Bush, dude, honestly. Now they'll switch it up, looking to throw the ball here. I suck. They can't stop him. Tackle made after a big game. Well, it's one thing to hear about how fast this receiver is in the scouting report. You look at him on film all week. The defense coordinator tells you, get ready, this guy can run. And then the reality comes. And this guy can fly. You see it again here. Nice catch. I'm liking this 4-2-5, man. I think it um fits us pretty well. So down here in the red zone, every four three was just not cutting it, bro. It really wasn't. They'll give it to the running back. That's a nice tackle there by the senior. The casino blitz. USC in front, Kirk, as we break for the quarter. So three quarters complete in this battle to crown a national championship. Before moving on, let's check out the game summary so far. I'm like still thinking about when was the last national. I guess it was the was it that Orange Bowl, right? Because I'll never forget the fucking one that we lost against Texas. That one still hurts me to this day, man. Reggie Bush fucking sold us so hard. That fucking crazy ass pitch he did. Fuck, I've seen that too. I thought he was gonna do an out route. You know, sometimes you just have to feel sorry for the defense. You've got everything covered. The backs, the receivers, everybody's accounted for. And here comes the tight end slipping out and taking a short pass to the end zone. Great play. Oh shit, they're going for an onside. No. Able to recover the football. All right, let's just uh. And here comes the USC offense back on. Let's just run this clock, bro. Field with serious momentum, they have been tough to stop so far. Can they keep it going? Great spot to start this drive. I came out with a different strategy this game, dude. I don't know if you guys noticed this shit. I'm coming out in five wide, and then I'm switching the play to maybe either run or run something else. Or unless the five wide is there, then I'll throw it somewhere. But the reason coming out for five wide is to make them come out like in a, you know, in a bigger defensive formation. You know, whether it's like dime or whatever. And that way, when I run the ball. You know, they got less dudes on the fucking line. And now the handoff. Defense gets him down, but they'll take trying to get back to the plays that I, I'm trying to get back to the shit that I used to do back in the day. There's so much shit that I'm trying to still brush up on. Another nice carry here because it's been that kind of game in the national title. We knew coming in that he was going to be showcased. I didn't think he would have this kind of performance on this big of a stage, but he has. And a big reason why they're going to win this national title. I'm telling you, my my days when I played 06 through through 12, man, oof. I was very creative on offense, man. Both on fucking Dynasty and on PvP, dude. Playing just regular teams and shit. I always stood behind my Trojans though, every single time. It's my team. 
use that running game, trying to bleed the clock here. And tackled after a small pickup there. Offense getting set. Second down play here. Let's get under center, actually. Actually, let's go on the... Go on the pistol. And the running back takes the handoff. Soft. Just soft, man. Solid gain that time. The Trojans are moving quickly down the field. Yeah, I like this call here late in a game like this with the lead. Nothing too fancy. Just right up the middle. Trust that offensive line and this running back and just keep working that clock. They're going to run it. You ain't going to tell me twice, dude. We run the ball around here. Now that we're in the fourth quarter, it's been a tough day for them. And the offense is taking advantage of it. A lot of positive plays. Good job of eating as much clock as they can here on this drive in the fourth quarter. Yeah, we're doing this. I want to go home already. The offense with some pre-snap eye candy. I want to go home. Ooh. Couldn't quite get there. Brought down at the two. The Trojans hoping to punch it in here. They have first and goal. Boy, this offense just seems to get more confident as this football game is played out. They've got a nice lead. Here they are in the fourth quarter, just working that clock, possessing the football, and trying to get out of here with a nice, solid victory. Back in motion now. They flip it to him on the jet Block, field. man. Touchdown. Yo, I've noticed, I mean, I don't run the jet sweep very often, but I've noticed that the few times that I've run it, I think this season I maybe only ran it like a handful of times, but every single time I've run it, they be blocking, dude. They be blocking. I like it. I'm gonna have to run that play a bit more. It's just a little sketchy because I'm not really much of a jet sweep kind of guy. <laughs> Looks like he'll try to make a play with the I have a lot of uh, bad experiences with it from the older games. I used to run it a lot, like just running as a as a play action type of thing. But I was never fully comfortable with actually running it, running it. Winding down, and they'll take a deep shot. Caught way downfield for a huge gain. They bring him down, but not before an explosive play through this offense through the air. Was I in cover four or cover three that last play? Because the fourth quarter, you're down big, but who knows? Ain't nobody was over there. Try to get in the end zone, maybe get an onside kick. Give me that. Oh, oh give me that. Oh, arrived the same time as the football, and now it's second down. That was a hell of a play. Sheesh. Is that a counter that they run? Didn't get to see it. Maybe something positive can come out of this. You're going to have some bad games from time to time. We'll see how he gets his team ready in the future. But that right there, man, that's what they've been looking for all game. The game makes it second. We're minute 20 away from holding this freaking trophy, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Tackle is but the game sets the offense up. First and goal from the nine. Fresh set of downs. I know I've given my sh I know I know I've given my team a lot of shit all season, dude. Just defense. Offense offense has been looking crisp all year. But defense, I've given a lot of shit to them, dude. But I'm happy we're about to hold this trophy up right now. I never satisfied, you know? Give me that. Oh. They can make so many right plays. As soon as they make one bad play, it's like I'm like, nope, our defense is shit. <laughs> Looking downfield, it's McCord. That was all me. Now we held up nice. And now 
the try here for the extra point. All those tough games we played, man, has led to this has led to this freaking uh, beat down on Syracuse. Did I go for an onside? Really? Yeah, they definitely don't want to be here. Sheesh. That shows it all right there. That one bounces through the end zone, so they'll start at the 25. All right, man, let's go home. And the Trojans' offense is back out on the field. Let's go home, dude. Fine feeling for this team. Just run out the clock and let the celebration begin. So with the lead secure here, it's time to just take a knee, run out the clock, and plan the victory celebration. USC, USC. Are we back? I think we're back. At least for now. We'll have to see how this recruiting class goes, man. I know there's quite a few people we didn't get that I really wanted to get, but... I'm very happy. I'm very, very happy with the outcome here. We smacked the shit out of Syracuse, man. <laughs> I didn't feel no pressure against these guys at all. Give us that damn trophy. Let's go, dude. Let's go. What a freaking season, dude. Dude, if you watched the very first game we played against LSU, how lost I was, because, like, one, I hadn't played this game in, like, since freaking 2011, 2012. I didn't have no playbook yet. Oh, man. We finally found our playbook, like, midway. I think it was, what, after Penn State or some shit? I forgot. No, no, I think it was right before Penn State. It took us a little while, dude. And even with defense, it's like we just barely found a playbook that I think I'm going to kind of stick with for now. Because 4-3 was not working, dude. 4-3 was tough, man. It just wasn't it. Fight on, motherfuckers! Syracuse, GG, man, GG. I barely even threw the ball this game. I'm on nine for ten. Shish. Joiner freaking went off, dude. 114. Yeah, receivers. Yeah, we didn't. We didn't really pass the ball too much that game. 